husband, after she died, used to stay in the house because he said that his wife was around and he couldn't bear to leave her. And he himself eventually became a recluse and lived in the room beyond this. And this was his chair and he sat in it. One night I was coming through, about nine o'clock at night, none of us in the house smoked. And I smelt him smoking his pipe as he was puffing the tobacco smoke in my face. And I was quite shocked. And then there was an occasion when the dog looked up, looked at the chair and started wagging his tail. And there have been a number of different things attaching to that room. And we felt that there was something in the room that we could not define it. We were certain that it was Mr. Hayden himself. And I'd like to carry out a little experiment. After all, we live in skeptical times. Uh, would you care to sit in the haunted chair? sitting one night telling ghost stories and I mentioned the fact that there was a haunted room in the house and I mentioned the fact that there was a haunted chair in that room and I said that one of them was sitting in it and there was a very heavy silence and a very timid voice spoke up and